Hello YouTube and thank you for watching. Uh, today I am going to be showing how to debug an anonymous PL SQL block and the tool that we'll be using is the SQL developer. Sometimes you have a script that you want to execute uh, which may contain a loop uh, that executes multiple times and it throws an exception and you're trying to figure out what's causing that and the best way to do that is to use the debugger and step through the code uh, and add some watches uh, to see what is happening. So the first thing we're going to do is set up the environment by going into the tools, preferences, and in the debugger option, make sure that you selected the step into. Click OK. Now you open a SQL worksheet, connect to the database, and we're going to be using a very simple anonymous PL SQL block uh, that contains a loop. And to start the debugger, what you do is you right click and choose the debug option. Uh, you can also use the keyboard combination Control Shift F10, which will do the same thing. So this launches the debugger, and by default, it stops on the first line. If you look under the run option, uh, these are the commands that you can use. The F8, the F7, and the Shift F7. And I am going to step through the code using F7. So now we're interested in what is the variable X as it executes. So under the watches, you can see the value changing as the code is executing one line at a time. Hope you found this information useful and thank you for watching. 